one. This is the first of some tutorials on how to use Inkscape and the Polyshaper plugin. If you are watching this video, it means that uh, you probably bought a P400 on Kickstarter or one of our machine, custom machine that we do. So, first of all, let's check how to install the Polyshaper plugin. First, you have to Google GitHub Polyshaper Inkscape. Click on the link, the first link that appeared. And this is the web page on GitHub of our repository for our plugin. Click on button clone or download, then download zip. This, is, this will require just a couple seconds, no more. That's it. Now, go into Inkscape to understand where we have to put the contents of our plugin. Go into Edit, Preferences. Now, often if you, the first time that you open this window, this window should appear very little like this. So you have just to enlarge by clicking on the right bottom corner. Then click on system and in this part of the window you will find user extension. Here is where you have to copy the files of our plugin. So I have downloaded this one, Polyshaper Inkscape, Polyshaper, plugin, now copy everything with the except of the first file. Right click and copy. Then we have to move into users, Flavio Practice is my name, in your case it will be the name of your computer, dot config. then Inkscape extension Inkscape extension and copy the content of the plugin into this folder in other case for Windows users the, the way it's uh, practically the same just we have to follow the path that are highlighted here all right now close you have to close Inkscape and open it again and if you did everything well now in extension you have to find Polyshaper to the machine this is our plugin that is correctly installed let's verify if it's so now for example we can draw a simple circle, something like that. All right. Extension. Uh, you, of course, you have to check that the the path is selected before use the plugin. So extension, Polyshaper, to the machine. You don't have to touch nothing here for the moment. Then apply. And it say that the generated G code has been saved into users Flavio Practico with the name Polyshaper 00.g code. And in this case, in any case, in any in any operating system, uh, you have to check in the main folder of your computer. In my case, Mac user, it will be the name of my computer. And I can find the generated G-code here, polyshaper00.gcode. Alright. 